Hi there, Homestead. It's Elizabeth from Community, and today we're going to go over the payment provider options in Website Builder e-commerce. So to get started, you're going to want to log into Website Builder. Once you're logged in, you're going to click on Store on the left panel, and then you're going to click on Manage Products and Orders. This will bring you into the store settings. Once that's loaded, you're going to click on Settings on this left menu and scroll all the way to the bottom where it says Payment Providers. Click Edit, and these will bring you into the Payment Provider options. There are three options when it comes to Website Builder e-commerce. You can either use PayPal, Stripe, or Cash on Delivery. PayPal will have customers log into a PayPal account or create a PayPal account and then they can either pay through their PayPal account or with a card. Uh, you can use Stripe, which is a credit card payment processor, and they can use Visa, MasterCard, American Express, or Discover. So with those two, it's really personal preference as to what would be the better option for you and for your customers. Or you can activate both to give your customers the option to choose what's best for them. Cash on delivery is the ability to let your customers skip the online payment and pay you directly as you deliver it. Um, this is probably the least popular option because it sort of depends on local delivery, but you can definitely offer that as well. So you just need to click activate to get it set up on either one. Um, for the cash on delivery, if you click activate, it's going to just have you enable the option. For Stripe and PayPal, it's going to have you enter in information to connect an account. Since these are third-party merchants, they do have their own separate accounts. So if you click Activate with PayPal, it's going to have you enter in the email address connected to your PayPal account, and then you click Submit. For Stripe, it's going to ask you whether you need to connect an account or create an account. If you click Create an Account, it's going to have you input an email address that you want to use. If you click Connect an Account, it's going to bring you into the Stripe website to set up the account information to be connected with Homestead, and then you authorize access to this account. After you're done, you'll be taken back to Homestead. So they're super simple to connect um, in the information for each processor. It does tell you their fees. Um, both Stripe and PayPal are the same with that, so one is not cheaper than the other. That just takes you one step closer to being ready to publish and go live with your store. So take the time to set that up. Stay tuned for the next video.